is ago. So that has two consequences. People don't remember what a council is supposed to do. Even the people who work in the council don't know what an elected council is supposed to do. The people of the municipalities themselves have forgotten that they have the right to control the municipality. They have forgotten that the people on the council or the people who run the council are accountable to them. That's all forgotten. Those of us sitting in here are politically aware. We assume that when they switch on the light next year, everything's going to go back to how it was in 2005. It ain't. Because people don't give a flying, you know what, anymore. Because they don't remember it. The best example that you can take is Sukuna Park. In the city of Suva, which is the biggest municipality in the country, with the biggest population, Sukuna Park, which is our center of the city, a facility that was widely used by all sorts of people, was blocked off and has been blocked off, I think now for two years, with absolutely no public outcry. There's no call for accountability. People are just so complacent. They don't understand that they have the right to control it. And even, you know, I'll tell you a story. Even though the Fiji Times is 100 meters away from that closed off park, they've never really given any attention to it. And that shows what has changed within our local government society. It also tells you the amount of work that needs to be done. It is also relevant to the electoral design because you cannot assume when you're picking your electoral system that people are going to behave as they do for the national elections. That they're all ready to vote, they're mobilized, and people will turn out and you will get the numbers. In fact, if you go back in history prior to 2005, the level of local government engagement, both at registration and at polling, is shockingly low. Was shockingly low in the good times. It's going to be worse when we come back unless major work is done. And my recollection and God knows it's, it's two decades ago that I was in charge of elections, but my recollection is that in many towns we had to adopt the rate book because there was no, very little voluntary voter registration. Okay, so these are some of the issues we need to be thinking about when you're choosing electoral system. Uh, other things that I, I think we need to be aware of is how much has changed in the last 19 years in the muni municipalities themselves. If you take somewhere like Suva, Suva has lost most of its residents. They're all out in Nausori and in, in, in the Nasinu municipality. They're no longer here. Uh, we've lost because of, some would argue, retail section, uh, the retail sector will argue, because of poor local government administration, lack of accountability, we have lost a lot of retail in Suva. It's now out in Nasinu. So the needs for Suva are quite different from, let's say, Levuka. We need a council that knows how to revive life in the city that caters for Suva as a destination, that knows how to meet the, the attract uh, tourists, knows how to provide services to workers who work in the city but go back and live in Nausori. It's a very, very different situation and we need to bear that in mind when we are designing. <laughs>